from across the Europe, Spell des Ocean, beautiful ship, and sailing in the Canary Islands on a brand new Canary Island island hopping cruise. This is my cabin, it's a balcony cabin for two people, and it's really lovely and exotic. I think there's only six cabins on the ship that have a balcony on deck six, so I'm feeling very lucky. Let's start with the bed. Don't you just love the blue velvet throw and the velvet cushions? Let's get on the bed to try it out. That feels nice and sturdy. We know that Go With Joe likes a nice, sturdy, firm mattress, and this is definitely that. On the end of the bed is a little treat. Actually, two treats they give me really big mega chocolates. That is no mean um, chocolate on the pillow. So thank you very much for that, Cosy Europe. And now moving on to the desk area. Again, everything feels oversized, not just the chocolates, but the chair too. Look, that's one big chair. I'm gonna try it out for size. Really, really generous chair. Lovely desk as well. On it, you'll see the kettle, the telephone. There's a lovely tea selection here as well. You've got coffees, you've got breakfast tea, mint tea and chamomile, etc. And then you have water and flannels. That's quite nice there, sitting there. It feels very upmarket and stylish. There is a fridge here. It is empty because everything is included. You have free wine with meals, you have free beer, free soft drinks as well so there's no need really to fill up that mini fridge there and i love how the cabin feels really exotic the ship has sailed in faraway lands apparently it was made in japan and the pictures really give that vibe to the ship a polar bear there and a nice arctic scene there as well now for the rest of the cabin there's a lounge area which makes the cabin feel really spacious here you go lovely seating area look it can seat about five people here. I can have a party in my cabin. The balcony is here. I'll be showing you that later. There you go. It's a lovely view of the sea outside, the Atlantic Ocean. Moving on, we have the TV behind me there. I haven't tried it out yet. It's not massive, but I'm not particularly interested in the television and what's on it anyway. Um, here we have a whole drawer area and lots of great mirrors. I can see myself everywhere all around the cabin, you'll see where the covers come up there, I'll show you those. There's a lot of mirrors and that again gives a great sense of space. There are like five drawers here, actually four, there's one deeper one there too, another stool there and if you come here there's a lovely hairdryer and laundry bag and sewing kit there. Um, it's quite a sweet little desk area actually, I like that a lot and the safe is in there. And there's even incense burning up here, so it smells lovely in the cabin too. Now, let me show you here, if I may. We've got a lot of cover space, lots of mirrors here, and if I open these, I will show you what's inside. We have plenty of floor to ceiling. That really is floor to ceiling there, and they've given us some slippers, as you can see. And then next to that is another set of cupboards life vests up there and plenty of hanging space and i have put some things in there already then if i crouch down we have i think another drawer here actually oh i've never had that in any cabin ever a nice drawer for shoes or anything another one there that's great and opposite the cupboards is the bathroom this is an older ship it's been bought from silver sea so it's not brand new but it's still feels lovely, it's been recently refurbished. I really like the marble and wood effect in the bathroom, it's got a big shower head, it's also got a handheld shower, and look at that, the dark wooden teak floor with a marble effect trimming and on the sink too. I really, really like that a lot. And Quasi Europe have their own toiletries, I've had them before on a different ceiling, they're very, very nice. And you've got all the amenities there, shower caps, etc and plenty of towels and now for the balcony it's not big it's possibly the smallest balcony i've ever had on a cruise ship but it's big enough for a yoga mat and it's nice for my own personal space i do like having my own space and balcony on a ship let's push that door there hello atlantic ocean come with me let me help the camera woman 
come out. Here we go. And you will see what I mean. It's quite deep. It's a good space for a yoga mat. And in a second, I'm going to show you the chairs and table. There we go. There are the chairs and the table. And the view today is of a big piano ship over there and Lanzarote, one of the Canary Islands, over the other side. Also worth mentioning is that the plug sockets are Korean and so they give you those little black adapters at reception which work with the European adapter into it. And for any of you worrying about burning incense, fear not, there is no flame or fire, it's just a lovely aroma coming from that pot. And also just to mention one of their bedside tables is actually a speaker, the ship announcements come through it into your cabin so make sure you twiddle with the knobs and bring it down to zero but really you can sometimes hear them so bring with you some earplugs. There you have it, the cabin. I really hope you found my review useful. If you have please give me the thumbs up and please don't forget to subscribe to my channel. There's going to be more videos on the whole ship and on some of the Canary Islands too so check out for that and with love from me in Quasi Europe, thumbs up and happy travelling! <laughs>